Hey everybody, it's Janique here. It's kind of late, but I just got home. Super Bowl. Woo I didn't really have a team I was cheering for, but it was a good game. Um, I really enjoyed the one of the last touchdowns that were made. And the guy turns around and he leans back and falls into um, the end zone. So that was pretty cool. Um, got to spend some time with friends I hadn't seen in a while. So that was cool. Something I noticed, um, when you start feeling it better about how you look and how you feel and that your clothes can fit. Um, it changes your whole look out, outlook on life. Um, before when I couldn't fit my clothes and like that, people would invite me places and I'd just be like, you know, I didn't want to go. I had no desire to go. And when you start feeling good about yourself and, you know, liking how you look and feeling confident, you know, you're more likely to go out and about and socialize with people. Um, but people don't always know that. And you don't always know that um, when you're in the middle of it. So... Um, right now I'm at 175.2. I got on the scale at my godparents' house today, so that confirmed everything. Um, and that was cool. Um, I think it's probably going to start falling off probably like two pounds a week, something like that. But I've got to do my measurements tomorrow because I just keep forgetting. I'm going to do my measurements tomorrow. Um, my cousin, she's kind of doing this other kind of thing but she started off basically like paleo and um it was actually really cool she's already lost in a i think less than a week she's lost about seven pounds so i'm really proud of her Woo -woo -woo. keep it up girly um and so we're kind of doing this weight journey together she doesn't quite have as much to lose as i do but you know every you know it's it's so interesting because everybody has their size, the size that they want to be, and it doesn't matter how big or how small you are, everybody has that look that they want for themselves. And so realizing you shouldn't compare yourself to other people because everybody's going to be different. Um, so today, of course, was Super Bowl Sunday, and I went over. I, was, I wasn't nervous, but I went prepared. I had my meals with me. Um, I had my, um, my fit food stuff that I ate. That's my dad. Um, he's half asleep. I hope I didn't wake him up. Um, but I have my MyFit food stuff with me and, you know, going prepared, knowing that my options were the food that I brought, was the food that I brought, was, was a plus. Um, let's see, I, um, so I took, I had some meat patties, which I actually came up with a new dish. Um, it's basically the turkey patties, turkey, ground turkey patties, and then salsa. It was so good. I'm like, oh my gosh, I think what I'm going to make next, I'm going to make my own guacamole and do like a Southwestern kind of sandwich and wrap it in like lettuce. So as soon as I make that, I'll post the recipe, my own little creation. I'm sure there are probably recipes out there already, but I'm going to try to create my own little thing, but I am going to have to look up how to make guacamole. I think it's pretty easy. I know you need avocados and some other stuff. I can't remember what other stuff. Anyway, so I'm going to do that. Um, so they had like, I mean, they had great food. They had, you know, chips and salsa, you know, the typical foods that you eat at, you know, Super Bowl party. And honestly, like I said, I knew what my foods were and I wasn't swaying anybody else from eating their foods. And I was just like, that's not what I eat. Thank you though, but that's not what I eat. You know, I didn't say it like that, but you know, they kind of already know. Most of my friends already know what I'm doing anyway. So, um, did that. They had some baked or some grilled chicken, you know, from the pit. So I ate some of that barbecue chicken. I ate some of that. And then I had a sausage. Now, I don't think I'm supposed to eat sausage because I believe of, because it's processed. I don't know what type of sausage it was. So I can't make an educated guess. Tastes good, but a little later on, my stomach had like a little faint, little sharp pain. And I was just like, hmm. I don't think that's good. So right now it's still kind of hurting a little bit. So be careful of the meat. Even though you can eat meats, be careful of the meats that you choose to eat because it might not be good for you. Um, but it's really interesting to see how like my body is responding to these foods. It's amazing. It's really just amazing. So anyway, um, I was sore yesterday. I stretched. I was a little sore today and I stretched. Um, so now I'm actually not really that sore, so I'm going to pick it up pretty hard um, this coming week. Um, starting tomorrow with day three of the challenge, I've got to post that video from day um, two. Um, what else was I going to tell you guys? 
that's pretty much it that I that I had to report. Um, I'm just excited. There's so many converts to paleo, and they realize like you know it's a choice that you make, and if it's a choice that's right for you, then go for it. You know, some people like I say all the time, some people don't have to go to this you know extreme or whatever. But you know what? I've it's a really really nice feeling to feel good when you wake up, and I'm working on building a schedule because I work kind of for myself and I kind of work outside of of myself. Um, it's just really important for me to um, make sure that I plan out my day so I'm not wasting a lot of time. Really trying not to be lazy. Sometimes I can be creatively lazy and not push my business as hard as I should. So if you're interested, check out my site, um, jlacourphotography.com, J-L-A-C-O-U-R photography. Hope you can spell that. I've spelled it wrong before, uh, .com. Or you can check it out on Facebook at jlacour photography. Um, so yeah, that's pretty much it. If you like what you see, press like, thumbs up. Um, if you're interested in my services, let me know. Shoot me an email. Um, and if you want to subscribe or tell your friends about the journey, find out more about paleo. I, I'm still reading my book from Mark um, Sisson, um, Primal Blueprint. So anyway, excited about that. Uh, I think I might go do some sprints tomorrow. So I got to go find me a field. It might be a little wet because it rained here, but we'll see. Thanks again and God bless. Later.